is the hydraulic unit for stretching the cables. And over here is the actual hydraulic ram that pulls on the cables. So we'll watch it here in action. Okay, here they're stretching cables. So they're putting the, the uh, device on. Turn on the machine. You can see the rams start pulling. And there's a pressure gauge on the meter. And there's uh, paperwork that tells it how high the pressure has to go to get the correct pull. Pulls the cable and that's it. So, nothing uh, super exciting. Cuando la pongas, mientras no se regresa, okay. no, no, no hagas fuerza para que... Well guys, uh, it's been, this is the sixth working day since uh, the foundations were poured and I thought I would uh, give you a quick view. Um, we've uh, dug up the fronts of all these to start installing sewer and water, which of course uh, is not uh, job site friendly for our framing contractor here. And as soon as these get backfilled, then we're going to dig for uh, PG&E services. So just makes his life tougher but as you can see uh, the uh, they've their uh, the first house here or the last house in production is plated and they'll start uh, framing on that and they've uh, stood walls uh, going down second house the walls are stood uh, the next house is um, walls are stood and they probably started uh, uh, straight lining the plates and as we get uh, Further down the project, um, you can see the fella up there, maybe up on top. Um, the far end of the project, they're already rolling floor joists. Um, two of the houses have floor joists on it. Um, and by Friday, um, we are shooting for uh, subfloor nail inspection on all six homes. So, uh, job site's moving along uh, fairly well. All right, guys, catch you all later.